Good morning, today we have a special surprise. We're driving a Tesla, but that's not the surprise. Look Hello. <laughs> I know, I read your comments, we're here. It's okay, you can fucking stop now. <laughs> it's okay. It's your channel, I could actually swear. Yeah, you can, you can oh. fucking swear up a storm. Yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> it's the sheep. Oh, Liam, can you scooch please? Thanks. There's the sheep. They're scared of Aren't us. They... Yeah, they're scared of us. Could you imagine? Prey animals being scared of you? <laughs> but look at them. They're sheep. Yeah. They look like our sheep. They they're are. They're very the... prime one. Yeah. Well, they're very composite. So. Look, prime they... ones are composite. Yeah. yeah. So, so it's. Yeah, they're just mutts. They're just Canadian's version. Yeah. Yeah. Sandy's version. Not even Canadian. I can't even mm -hmm. say that. Canada's mutts. It's uh, Sandy's mutts. Yeah, you can rename, rebrand. Mm -hmm. Sandy's Mutt. Sandy's Mutt. But there's the rams. Yep. Some of them. Yeah. Their rams don't stink as bad as our rams. I don't know. Your rams that. actually smell pretty good. Uh, they, right. get, they get cloned every morning. They get squirted. Do they? Yeah. Oh, fuck the wood. Some yeah. aftershave. <laughs> Give, shave their beards. Because I, I, only, I, only I only have pets here. Yeah, it's only pets. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah we've got how many sheep? I have 400. We've got 400 pets-ish. Yeah, 400 pets. 400 pets. Yep. That one's name is Susie. There's Susie. Today. Yes. I'll forget who she is tomorrow. That's all right. They all, they all look very similar, apart from, like, the spotty ones. Yeah, I know. That's why I fall in love. That's why I have pets, because when they are a different color, it's like... Have a bit of flavor. They do have some flavor. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. We have some silver, some black, some brown, black and white... Yeah, we're you got you got different ones. We're very diverse here. We have one with a chin strap at the moment. A oh, black chin strap that really looks like he's got a helmet. It's like a little you could call him like George Washington. Oh no, he's getting sick. Oh. <laughs> he's probably gone now, really. That's why. Dad took care of him. Yeah. Chin, old chin strap. Yeah, he, he's gone. He's probably on the truck. Old he's, he's on the truck to the butterfly farm. Truck to here. To, this is the butterfly farm. Yeah, this is the, the butterfly shape. farm. Yeah. yeah, that's right. This is where they go. That's across the road. We have a Golden Girls across the road. We have oh, is that where they I are? I have a retirement village across the road. So I do have pets. Partly that's too because I get a lot of hate that my sheep are inside. So now I can like I can go over to the Golden Girls and say no. Some of them are outside. You just copy paste them outside. Yeah. And then they're all outside. That's right. I should. Yeah. And just open the door up and let them out. My biggest let thing is I tell the sheep every day: if you're nice to me, and we become friends, you get to stay forever in the Golden Girls Retirement Village. They just don't listen to me. So what are they doing there? Over in the retirement village. Yeah, go ruffle. They're retired. Meat ruffle. Bingo. Meat tray. Do you have meat trays here? What do you mean meat trays? We have meat tray raffles. That's so really you, you cool. go into the raffles and then Meat's you win a expensive. meat tray. Meat's too expensive. Yeah, exactly. Oh. Oh, I want. They are. They're very scared. Very sheepish. Imagine that. Me. Yeah, we'll have to say them. And do you have any lambs left? Uh, yeah, the December lambs are all over this. So. Uh, we'll yeah. have to look yeah. at the lambs and compare yes. to our winter <laughs> I know if we'll only have spring left here. So there you go. Yeah, yeah they'll be, uh, so they're born in December. Where are we now? March? Three March. months old. So they're in their prime right now. Yeah. They should be starting to go on good. a truck soon. No. To the rainbow. To the rainbow farm. They, the come, rainbow they farm. come to Australia. And they go out they in the do. pasture. That's right. Yeah. That's where mine go and yours come here. Yeah, mine come here. Into yeah. the barn. Yeah. 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 So what's this? Some silos. What's that? <laughs> What's this? Oh, these are, okay, so these are grain bins. Uh, some people put up more like cement silos, but here in Canada, we store everything differently than the Aussies, just because we are dealing with snow and cold. And so this is this is a typical. Mark, you should be talking to this. He's gone. So it takes less. It's less of a footprint. So it takes less land to build up. Yeah. Than to build like flat like you guys we have silos you do have silos we do have silos not like this like your farmhouse silos is that no, no. is that the norm in we, australia we all have silos um oh, oh excess grain you dump on the ground you put right. tarp down you same with tarp same over. with our elevators yeah. too if they've got too much then it's a pile yeah if, it, if yeah. you're dumping grain on the ground it's normally it's either feed or it's going to be picked up with the right. loader as soon as the grain right. prices go right. back up. Right, right, right. Yeah, but our okay, silos... Okay, so you guys are in bins and silos too. Yeah, we've got silo probably that size. We don't have anything like that. That's 
and, and we're massive. not i would say like like we're a mid-size farm in ontario we're not big at all yeah um there's guys that are much much bigger with much larger facilities but quite often they also receive grain too so then they have to be licensed so they would have a scale and yeah they'd have to be audited and all that stuff but we just we only store our own crops here so most of this is corn storage i think we've got two bins allocated for seed soybeans because we grow seed soybeans for pioneer and then uh i think we might have one for wheat and maybe one more for soybeans but the rest is all corn a lot of corn and then then that white one we actually have malted barley uh we grew we grew some winter barley for a couple of years and we're actually feeding the sheep with it, but we also might make beer with it. Yeah, you could have it. You could have yeah. a brewery. Well, we have- You could sell beer. So that was the whole thing. We yeah. have friends that run a brewery really close to us. Yeah. And so that's why we grew it, but we didn't know who could malt it. And then we actually, the people that had made that sourdough bread that I was talking yeah, about, yeah. they malt barley. So they offered to, to do, do it for us. So we might have like our own little- You know what? We might have our own little beer. Someday. You could. Yeah. In Australia, we went, it was in the middle of oh, fuck nowhere. <laughs> and, as it is. Yeah, as, as it is. And they had a brewery and they made their, they somehow put sheep shit into it to add to the flavor. It's and like, no one had a problem with that. No, no. It, it's it, like it was, a novelty. It's a, del it's a delicacy. It's a delicacy. It's like, it's like where it's the, like the cats, it's like the coffee bean cats. You know about the coffee bean cats? Nope. So they, they, they've got cats. It's a very expensive coffee. And they, they have the cats eat the coffee beans okay. and then shit them out and then people drink it. Why? Because they can. Because they can. <laughs> they, they like to taste. They're into some I kinky don't know. shit. I'm this is Mark's domain. This is not my domain. It's clean in here. Oh it's my God, suspicious. It's not. Yeah. Can you else? Well, You've got wood. Well, We've got, you, where your Mark, wood is. Mark does a lot of carpentry. A lot of carpentry yeah. on, in his spare time. We've got the, in our shed. It's metal, but it's everywhere. Dad keeps everything. A little bit of it's going to be useful. It's going to be useful one day. It is useful when you go to throw it out. Yeah, well, we, we do. You, you we throw do. it out, and the next day you're going to be looking for the thing you threw out. There. Yeah. Automatically. See, so like the, the snapped be the snap yeah. beam there. Yep. Yeah. Half of it's still good. Yep, hundred percent. Or you're gonna use that for weld it back together. Gonna use that for something. Do you have an oxy? Trailer. Do you have an oxy here? Yeah, so we a welder? Who? Uh, what are they? Like a welder? No, we've got a welder and we've got an oxy. So is an ox? What is an oxy? Like an oxygen torch? Like a yeah, torch? yeah, yeah. We yeah, call yeah, it an yeah. oxy. Uh, that. Yes, yes, that's what it is. That's yes. An oxy. Yeah. We call it an oxy. oxy welder. Yeah, and then. Like, if something doesn't come off, yeah. we hit it with a hammer. Yep. That's and step two. Yeah. My favorite tractor. This one? My baby, yeah. Oh, this little one. Yeah, this yeah. is my baby. This oh, this is like the Deutz. Her name, her name is Fiona, Fiona the Pen. And then I loved it so much that I convinced Mark he needed a, a matching big one. So that's Freddy the Pen. Freddy and Fiona. Why isn't it Shrek? I know, I wanted him to call it Shrek, but he didn't. He's like, no, it has to start with an F. I'm like, no, you're missing the point. They're like Shrek Green, and that's why I named her Fiona. We don't have any green things. We've got Big Bird. Yeah, so you got a... <laughs> a cookie monster. So you got a yellow one and yeah. blue. We've got, oh, the cats. This one's ancient. A so we do a lot of different... We do a lot of European models now. And what Mark's found is the European equipment is a lot... Technical. They're, yeah, but they're just a lot better suited for how like how small our fields are and stuff like his not this stuff so much but the plant his planter and his air seeder and stuff yeah so we just we just really like i really like the fence like, yeah i drive this a lot when we it's got tr you got stuff. tracks on it's it got tracks on that yeah well we put tracks on because of mud <laughs> yeah is yeah. that what you need it for well, winter's a brute like sometimes so we're, we're combining corn sometimes and it can snow and then everything turns to mud. So this just helps carry. You're not doing as much damage to the ground. Like, I mean, you're uh, spreading yeah. it out a little bit more. That's the purpose. We have to wait for everything to be hard yeah. to harvest. Like, yeah. We, yeah, you were really wet this year. Yeah, we were wet. We couldn't bloody harvest because yeah. we'd go out there and then all of a sudden you yeah. sink. And yeah. it's like, oh, shit. Yeah. 
and they fucking dig, doing it, come dig the yeah. harvester out. Yeah. But tracks would be good, but then we're not meant to be wet when we harvest because they were There's, accepting. Yeah, especially with green. Yeah, well, we were, they were accepting up to 13% moisture when they only normally accept 11 this year. Just because so people get couldn't it get it off. Because it would be start sprout, starting to sprout. Well, yeah, we, we got another crop out of our crop. Oh, my God, because it just all we got, sprouted. Oh, oh the lambs God. loved it. They had but, a great yeah, time. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I need to ask, did you yeah. brush your hair this morning? Oh. <laughs> I curled it. Oh. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Well, I showered for the first time in, like, three days, so I thought I'd better make use of the shower. Because yeah. I usually shower before I go to bed. Yeah. So then my hair is always disgusting the next yeah. day, so I'll just put on two. But I had a lady that did not like that yeah. very much. She was, she, used, she was. She thought I would lose Mark she if I didn't do my hair oh, after 25 fucking, years of marriage. Fucking tough, Matt. <laughs> came from another woman. She's a little old lady. I don't know. She's a little old lady. Rude. I can find it. I got some pretty Oh. Mama Pad. This is not Ooh. the right channel for this, babe. Yeah, the steam pile of shit. Yep, piled higher and deeper. Got my, that's my PhD. Piled higher and deeper. <laughs> cheaper than an actual PhD. I know. We're it's looking worth, at... It's worth more. The... Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is the composter. This is the composter. We're not allowed to do this at home. This is insane. Like, we get government funding to do this. That's crazy. Yeah. What because, is chucking uh, Because in? nothing... The only thing that comes out are your bones, right? Yeah. There's a bone right there. A few bones there. That Sally and Susan. Oh, I don't yeah, know who pets. it is. They oh, it's like sausage none of my meat, is it? It's like a... Yeah, it's like, and actually, the place that I told you we were thinking about getting our stuff malted, yeah. they run the same sort of deal for, um, I think, cleaning their, because they do sprouted grains, so they have these on in a room, like, lined up, and they, it's awesome, they, they do, like, them out. they clean, clean their uh, grains and stuff in it, like pumpkin seeds, and so yeah. they can be used for different stuff, but, yeah, this is... This just heats, like you put it with a carbon source, so some straw. Yeah, just chuck some straw in there. Yep, some straw or some wood shavings. Yeah. And then uh, it creates heat, and then it turns once a day. You can turn it as many times as you think it needs it. Yeah. And then it spews out it's, at the end. Then what do you do with it? You can spread it. Typically what I do, because there's enough bones in it, I really don't want bones going to my tires. Yeah. I throw it back in. So I just let it again. keep going in. Yeah. Yeah. Because that's been from all winter, basically. I, it's not a real big pile. You could open a funeral director's home and just chuck, them, chuck, chuck all the chuck dead people there. on there. Yeah. Just chuck it in there. And then chuck them on the field. Yeah. And off they go. That's where the... Yeah, the feed the nation. Yeah, feed the nation. <laughs> Supposedly, yeah. you can hear a wheelchair in that because there was, a, I think, a guy that died and he had polio, maybe? He was in a wheelchair, so supposedly someone that can communicate with ghosts said they could hear a wheelchair in it. Spooky. You don't want to talk to the dead people? I don't want to see dead people or talk to them. What would you do if you came out here and there was just some bloke standing on your porch? Like, I have chills already, so you, mu you must have some drying energy. <laughs> Is that a door at hmm? the top that just goes to the roof, like to, to nothing? The chimney? No, the door on the second it? floor. Yeah, there's a door. So do art. Where's it fucking well, going? I don't know if ours did that. Okay, should you get on the art, roof? Mine at home had that growing up. They had like a whole, the house I grew up growing up had a, I think it was a boarding house. So they had a whole, like, sort of porch upstairs, too. Go again. Welcome. We might die. Welcome. I like to see you maintain your garden well. <laughs> oh, look at There's not even a... <laughs> no, we like, don't. Like, someone must have took that, because we had a screen there. Mm. Did you have asbestos oh, just, here? Yeah. Is that a thing here? What's that? Asbestos. Uh, I don't know. Likely. Oh, Likely. nice. Likely all of them. Welcome to our kitchen. Oh. I love what you've done with the place. Thank you, thank you. Looks phenomenal. Come on into the... What's the... Did you choose this? Um, this yeah. is... Yeah, I sure did. What the... <laughs> <laughs> this is called wallpaper, Tara. Uh, so this is what you would do with Liam if you need marriage counselling. You wallpaper your hands? Because you will need it when you're done. Oh my god, look at the top of it. Mm-hmm. That's called a border. 
It's what did the wallpaper it's a, big, it was a big deal in the 90s, 80s, 90s to do wallpaper and border. Oh. Yeah. It was a big oh. deal. Here's some more wallpaper. Flowers. Oh, this one's coming yeah. off. Yeah. I really yeah. like it. Yeah. Got some more. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah. I love Ceiling what you've done with the place. Yeah. These were big balloon curtains. That was a big deal. What do they do? Nothing. They just, they were a big deal in like the early 90s. But what do they do? It's like accents. It's a look. It's decor. This. Just pretty. You Wayne's cottage. If you say so. I like I never was really in this house when people lived here. So I think this was a bedroom. There's a pot. Look, we can do it. Oh, there's a pipe. Perfect. Probably finish that. Oh, there's another one. I do wonder how Hell this guy yeah. I do wonder how the this might be from the wheelchair guy. He's, he's doing yeah, quiet. He sits in here smiling sits in the watching like, through the window. He can see your house from here. He can he might be watching you he sleep. He probably is. Or watching <laughs> over me. That's what I like to say. Um, Look at this pipe. Sure. You're making me scare now. <laughs> <laughs> I have that effect room, on people. It's glorious room. What the fuck see? is it? What's this? What was it? Um, was it a bedroom? It's like a laundry room. I think it was laundry. I think yeah, you got it. I think it was laundry. Over. And then I think the bathroom is here. I, I see you've started to renovate. I think, I think this is... This is the bathroom. I think that's falling apart. Yeah, it's definitely... Where's the raccoons? I was promised raccoons. There's shit. Well, is that where the raccoons live? They're definitely here. I think maybe up in the attic. Raccoons come I don't know if they'll be here if they can hear us. No, I'm scared about this. Are we going to fall up there through the roof? Like, this never, never happened before with the carpet. So they've been like, trying to get... Ew. Ew. <laughs> yeah. It looks like a drug den, to be honest with you. It looks yeah, like someone a, should be like cooking meth. It's a meth. meth house. Yeah. yeah. Oh, look. He, that's not he, Jack, he's in the tools. Jack, Jack is my, this is my kid's Christmas card. <laughs> What'd you put it in here for? I did it. <laughs> it was an old man with the pipe went over your house, picked that out and brought it over. So our hired man used to live here, but he hasn't lived here for... Dear Monty, lots of love. Mark, Sandy, Jack and Jess. He obviously had a problem with you. He left your car behind. So when, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I think about you. Just kidding. Mm. All your baking mm -hmm. needs. Yeah. Oh, I need a new, I need a new masher. You, you want to grab it? Is that a fly swat? What is that? What's that? That's a fly swatter, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a good whisk. I could use that for my bottles. Mm -hmm. me. Oh, there's a book for you to read. That's, your, that, that's, that's, your, book. that's next month's book for your book club. <laughs> good one. I'll pass it by Jess. Okay, let me know. So when was the year on these papers? 2011. So that's when we were here. Look, look what's on you, the cover. You a used sheep. tough love a at sheep. sheep feeding time. It's like his What's that be. supposed to mean? I don't know. I'd have to read the article. <laughs> Shepherds should feed you what they need, not what they want. Oh, so it's inspirational. Yeah. Oh, there's some waspness. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. So You're feeding the what? This is this is wildlife habitat. I this. Know. We're we're honoring the ecosystem. Yes. Yep. You're giving back to. You're letting it go back to the right. earth. Keep out. Keep that out of sight. That was when they had pigs. That was their biosecurity. <laughs> Oh, this used to be a pig burn. That's a top. That's that, that's, that's that top red stuff. Sign you have on the front of your farm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Do not enter. Oh, that's gonna keep the people out. It looks like a meat freezer. Yeah. <laughs> Do you leave nuts on? Yeah, nuts stay on. But people eat the nut, eat the sheep with nuts here. I don't know if they eat them, but they I don't get discounted. So that's my number one question. Is like. Do you castrate your males and we don't? We have to. Yep. We they won't. We get we get punished if we don't. Because the meat goes I wonder young. if because we get rid of ours so quick. Like they're not, they're maybe not as old as yours when yours go to market. Like if you oh. shipped yours at like four months old, would they care? They go, one's born in July will go in June earliest would go in November. Well, how many months is that? July, August, September, October, November. Five, Five months, months old. Yeah. And they wouldn't accept They that. will not take it because of the meat. It taints the meat. Oh, it taints the meat. Oh, well. No, they, uh, they seem they to just, be okay with it. Yeah. That's crazy. Couldn't yeah. That would save us so much time, trying to find their little nuts in the fucking thing. Yep. I'd have a hard time. Oh, hello, little dude. <laughs> so some of these guys, these are some of the ones I think I might keep, these Tunis boys. Because they're just... Lovely. Are they the are they babies of red? Yeah. Oh. Like or the boys. I think just I have two Tunis dads and I think Oh look at this one. Yeah. 
Hello. The really friendly ones were bottle babies. I so they all have a yeah. purple dot on their bums. They were bottle babies. That's why they're friendly. That's why they're here. That's why they're, Actually, so that's why they're pets. Okay. Because they were probably bottle fed. That's, this isn't normal. This is not normal. So when you, normal. Guys, when you guys are getting really upset with Tara about her sheep sort of acting scared, the term sheepish is actual, it's actually legit. Sheep are so terrified of us, naturally. But when you raise them as a bottle lamb, they will forever and always assume you are their feed. Like they will always just think I'm going to feed them. And then they become and feed. Then, so, <laughs> Plot twist. Yeah. <laughs> they become what so, they desire. When people comment on Tara's videos that like, oh my God, Sandy Brock's sheep are so friendly. A lot of them are, number one, we're in a lot closer quarters. So I, I get to hang out with mine in, in a lot closer. And most of the time it's because they've been bottle, bottle fed. Like they're, they're, they're very used to human interaction. Whereas the ones that are raised by their moms are all those ones. They do not come down here because they're like, we're scared of this crazy woman. So, yeah. You don't probably bottle feed. You probably have some pets and then that's it because you don't bottle feed. And I mean, I don't like bottle, like if it's a matter of not having a pet and not bottle feeding, I would not have a pet. Like that, was, that would be the preference. But yeah. Are you looking at me? Are you the one that I see? Exclusive. Yeah, that's Where him. are they now? Yeah, this is him. This is the one I did all those shorts on, and they took him forever to drink. I think I tube fed him for like five days. And now look at him. He's still small, but he's a lot younger than the rest. That's the one you want to keep. Yeah, this yep. one. They're so cute. I don't know what they're in this kind of you can only have so many pets, just remember that. That's right. <laughs> There's only so many names. Are these your girls? There's another one. I like. Are these boys and girls? These just girls. They're all boys and girls together. I will, I will sort the boy and girl lambs if it's a group that I want to keep back for replacements. Yeah. But these were born in December, and I typically don't keep December lambs. Bad luck, dudes. So, born at the wrong time of year. It's a bad time of year. Yeah. So uh, this group that's lambing right now, Willow's group, they're the one that I really want to keep the replacements from. Uh. So. As soon as I bring them over, we'll do a weaning weight, and then I'll sort. Is that him? The females come off. That's one. Yep. Yep. The females will come off and go on that side, and then the males will stay on this side. This guy was huge. I weaned this guy, and he was. I think his weaning weight was over 100 pounds. He's 100 a pounds. sexy looking shape. Look at the shoulders. He's a big boy. Yeah. But he's a single. He's, he's a good one. He's a good ram. He'd be a good ram. Except for he's a single. But he is a nice. Look at the show is I on know him. he's a big boy, eh? He'd be a nice little roast. Here's another one I want to keep. Were you my bottle lamb? Rude. Yeah, my redheads. I want to keep my redheads. You're gonna end up with a flock of rangers. Yeah, I got. What are the out. chances of that? Oh, I know. We're getting freaky in the pen. Well, you can show it on your channel because <laughs> I can't show it on my. I have to edit all that out. If they start jumping each other, I have to edit it out. Really? Yeah, I get demonetized. Subs to me, it does. Yeah, you, you yeah. just wait. Oh. You're making fun of me, but you just wait. <laughs> that is a that fat is, fucking shit. That shape. is Big Mama's stand. She's always done that. She has this like sassy back side eye. That's what she does. That is a fat fucking shit. <laughs> She's not even the fattest one. She, big Mama's not as big anymore. They got a lot of wool too, but that's tomatoes. She was Belinda's popcorn. That's Ruby Sue. Her mummy just died this year. Ruby. Oh, I saw mm -hmm. that. Yes. Tomatoes, she's Belinda's, Billy's mom, big mama. They just do this, they like they can go outside. Oh, she shut the door. Well, they typically can go outside. I wouldn't want to be outside either. No, so they just it's hang out. fucking cold. They just hang out in here. You need a TV for them. What's that? TV for them. I should put a TV in here. I did put Christmas lights in here. And then I was like, Mark's like, you can't keep those on because this thing is just a big old match stick. Yeah. I'm like, oh, right. Yeah. Fair. So, yeah, so they're large. You could eat, oh, you could, mm. that's like a four person placement right there. Yeah. Steak dinner. Like a, yeah. Yep. Yeah. I just meant like a tabletop. You could oh, see it. I thought, like, I thought. Like a party of four around their, around their back. Uh, that's what, that's what Oakley looks like. Yeah. Like tomatoes. Yeah. The flat back. Tomatoes have such a funny, she's got like a little, sometimes she's got like her mouth almost looks like it's on the side, like a little side smile. <laughs> 
It's probably like a rye jaw or something, rye mouth. I should just play my channel on like Ruby. on loop, and they can look on at themselves loop. and they can like, watch themselves yeah. all day. Yes, and they look great. Yeah, they could watch. They could watch. I'm sure that content. would really count. Oh, fuck no. They're like, as long as we don't have to hear your voice all day, every day, because that would be pretty Mute. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm mute. I wonder if they'd watch it. Like, would they comp? Pipe, Piper comes in when the when Mark's watch. If, if Mark will only watch the YouTube videos that he's in yeah. of mine. <laughs> Sounds like someone. So, yeah. So he'll, uh, he'll have it playing in the living room and Piper will get up and stand right in front of the TV and watch. Watch yourself. Yeah. yeah, so the Golden Girls might like that. I think maybe you. They got, might. I think you might have something. There's, there. there's already power over there. <laughs> They're ready to go. There better not be. <laughs> These were all pig pens back in the day, yeah. and then uh, and there was a second story that we took out. So a pig barn, and then it was storage, and then it was a beef barn. You can see the beef yeah. handling stuff, and then now it's more storage and retired sheep. You don't even have a I'm bingo like thing for them. What's that? Bingo. You got nothing. I know. I should do something fun like that. You should do a bingo. Sheep bingo. Yeah, put their ear tags in, and then whoever gets it gets a treat. Charcuterie. <laughs> <laughs> you could. You a could, you could lay out a suit. You could. I could have like grain, and I could have a little hay, and... Bits and pieces. A little charcuterie board for my girls. And then you could serve it on, the, on their backs. Aren't they, like... Especially Marge, she hates my guts. She hates everybody, though. Hey, Marge. Why is she not a steak? Because I felt really exploitative. Because, like, like they their videos did so well. Oh, so they, there's a Hall of Fame? I, I, ah, I this just, is the I Hall of Fame. Really, I felt almost, I'm like, I couldn't, I couldn't put them on the track. I was like, you guys are like, and it was accidental. Like, I don't put out videos to, like, I just put out video. And people fell in love with them. And I did too. And I was just like, I can't. There's a few in there still that I'm like, you're never, you're never going on a truck because I, I can't actually physically put you on a truck. Um, Big Mama and Large Marge, like the internet fell in love with them, yeah. so they get to stay. That's why she has to lay down all the time because her legs hurt from carrying this channel. Yeah, she's yeah, she's got a lot of weight. She's yeah. got a lot of weight on those shoulders. Yeah, yeah. They're just eating each other. Billy's mom, stop eating her wool. Why are you doing that? The like, they're the most well-fed. This is what my rams, this is what my rams do. Oh, I've never seen yeah, that. What they the have fuck? no, did you notice how scraggy they were? They do they're eating all each winter. other. They eat, they eat each other's wool. See, they need a meat tray. <laughs> That's what they need. I talk to nutritionists, I talk to vets, and they're like, they're just bored. See, TV. They're just bored. TV. Yep. What, I don't understand, like, why are they bored? Like, our sheep just stand in a paddock. <laughs> well, they, yeah, they do the same thing. They're just they just Yeah, they just I stand know. there. Like, they eat, and, and they, they stand find there. somewhere to chill. That's yeah. all they do every day. But we we tend to think that animals do the same thing as the same things as we do. Yes. And we got to stop doing that because animals are not humans. Is they it do. because they have hay in it their could, wool it could and be. then they've, it they've be just they're looking for the chair. yeah they're eating the hay yep. and then they've they're yep. like mm, yep. what is this succulent morsel yep. and then they just eat each other yep but and then you'll come out she here he has the most delicious wool because no one else is missing their wool salt or grain i wouldn't be surprised because the seaway opened up i think yep because it wasn't frozen so i think they're gonna start loading boat you have to pay for parking now there <laughs> yep. Yep. We've paid twenty four dollars for the Niagara oh, Falls yeah. park. Isn't that we were there for I think awful. maybe ten minutes. Yep. <laughs> so this is a lake. It's not yeah. it's an is, ocean. This is a lake. lake. Yep. These are the Great Lakes. That's why people it's from us here are like this isn't an and, a lot of folks. Uh, the big thing about freighters is that they can't in the run in the lake. Get out oh, yeah. way because yeah. you only have so much room on the lake. Yeah. It looks like it's yeah. coming look this looks like the best strike. She smells. You know, when they get that smell, it's 
that's their pee when they pee. It's all, so it's like, I just call it like a ketonic pee. Like it's just, I'll know by the, I know by the smell when they're down. Yeah. So now she'll need glucose and calcium every day. Sugar. Twice a day. I'm glad our sheep ate grass. <laughs> <laughs> I don't you see don't even want to know how much money I spend on their rations so they don't get that. It's insane. Like I feed them a pellet with glucose in it. Trying to yeah, find the sheep. <laughs> one standing there. Yeah. Limpy, limpy one. Piper, get out of there. Piper's going to take her down. You don't have to deal with this most area. No. Oh, really? It has become the one true nemesis of my job. I hate it. I cross my fingers like the last two weeks of pregnancy. But they don't get it. Piper is looking at her butthole. Because <laughs> it's stinky. And the stinkier the better. Yeah, from stab. Not very good at flipping them either, actually. Oh, <laughs> so I don't know if you can see. You see her. What is that? Her vulva. Yeah. See how it's there's something sticking out of it. It's like a, a thing. <laughs> but see how it just sort of. It doesn't stream out. It like. Has she always been like that? Or is it recent? No. Just like started doing it right before we got home. Uh -huh. And then uh, I watched her. And I'm like, oh, it's maybe from the cedar. Because I thought she had a cedar. Yeah. And then I ran them through, took the cedars out. And I'm like, oh, that one never had a cedar in her. Because I couldn't get a cedar in her, which is a true sign of probably a hermaphrodite. And then, and then that's when I started treating her. I texted her the next day. He's like, no, she's looking after me. It doesn't look... I never said what she's streaming from. It looks so pretty it is from here. Pretty. This time of day, too, because the sun's sort of... The golden air. Oh, that was a hole. Because <laughs> you're done, girl. Yeah. Sweet. Sweet. There we go. We're getting there. Mm -hmm. So, that was a big... And it's done. We're on our way back to Toronto to get home. Thank you to Sandy and Mark and Jess for hosting us. They are absolutely lovely. I can't see because of the fucking sun. We had a great time seeing their farm and seeing around their area. It's quite, it's, it's very similar, but different to Australia. Like even just the area. I'm glad we don't have snow, to be honest with you. They are as lovely as they are on camera. That's it. Like or typo won't be here. <laughs> By my shit.